This is arguably one of the most automated car factories in China, or even on this planet. We got a chance to go deep inside. Walking through this corridor, we immediately go to our first stop, the paint shop. The core of the workshop is the giant vehicle storage system, what they call the cube. I prefer to call it a giant claw machine. Anyway, the six-story vertical garage can stock 246 vehicle bodies with two elevator handles helping to store and retrieve. This buffering process helps avoid constantly changing the spray gun. This lifts the overall production efficiency. Our current order to delivery process only takes 21 days. Next stop, body shop. In here, over 700 robotic machines are doing their jobs in an orderly fashion. But the leading technology here is what goes behind the fully automated door installation. The robotic machines are able to tightly and smoothly install the four doors to all of NEO's eight selling models with a tolerance of plus or minus 0.05 millimeters. It is about the same width as a single strand of your hair. As we were moving to our final stop, I unintentionally revealed my lack of knowledge. <laughs> These auto-guided vehicles, or AGVs, are everywhere in Neil's plant, especially in the General Assembly shop. They transport car parts or even car bodies to their designated locations with no interference from human beings. Of course, the robotic machines are programmed to avoid human workers too. Right here, the assembly line only moves when the workers stand behind this yellow line. And when they go into the yellow line and start to do their work, the assembly line stops thanks to the little sensor right here. And this is to ensure the workers' safety. China has been the world's largest new energy vehicle market for eight consecutive years. The country has witnessed a dramatic increase in the number of electric cars on its roads, with domestic manufacturers such as NIO gaining prominence. We don't mind showcasing some of our advanced technologies to our business counterparts. Only through mutual communication and collaboration can we better promote this industry. China used to rely heavily on foreign car brands and their manufacturer technology. But now, almost 80% of the country's new energy vehicle sales come from local brands. And boosted by the growth of new energy vehicle exports, China's total auto export has surpassed Japan to become the world's number one last year. So it is fair to say the Chinese car companies have become extremely competitive. Plus, that last part are not my words, but those of Elon Musk. Wang Tianyu. CGTN, Hefei, Anhui Province.